Hello everybody, I am Pumpkin Maniac, and welcome back to Stardew Valley, and, uh, you may be able to hear outside, but it's, uh, it's raining pretty hard. <laughs> eh, they're in good humor, that's good. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's shop got you covered. Stop by Pierre's general store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. His idea of affordable is, well, a thousand gold, so no thank you. Well, since it's raining and one of the item, one of the f things we need for the community center is only caught in the rain, why don't we go do that? First, let's collect a dandelion and a leek and a, and a daffodil and another leek. Only one of these do not give me energy, so we'll give this to somebody if we find them. Oh, as you can see, we have a seashell right here. And anything else? No. Well, we're going to go right over here, fish by this rock. And, uh... I guess I'll time-lapse this. Okay, we're definitely not time-lapsing that because that was the slowest two catches of my entire life. So, we'll come back another day. So, we could actually use the money, so... Chubs. I think we can catch Chubs up here, so let's go up to the mountains and catch some chubs. Ah, mountain fishing. This is the most treacherous area I've ever been. Oh, we can't go over there. Um, guess we're fishing off this. And now we're fishing in the mountain lake because why? Because, well, we were told to. So, yeah. We gotta catch, we gotta, we gotta bite. It, oh, it's fighting, oh, it's fighting. We got a fighter. Oh, oh, he, he's not moving because, uh, it's a largemouth bass. That's sad. That's very sad. I mean, I fish, I fish for bass and I've had a largemouth bass give me more of a fight than that. It is going to be impossible to catch anything with a higher rating than normal because I can't keep the green on top of the fish. Oh, we got one chub. I want that chest. I want that chest. We gotta get that chest. Stop moving. Stop moving. Got it. Got it. And we got the fish, and he was a bullhead. We got some coal, and we got some rice seeds, which I can grow immediately. It's good to know the game has has its uh is liking us today, because you know it's fun to play this game when the game likes you. No! I blinked. Just give me another chub. I need one more chub. And then I can get my 100 golds. Wow. You're fighting really hard right now. Does anyone else find fishing in Stardew Valley, like, really peaceful, but also really annoying? Because it's, like, it's difficult, but it's also not. I don't know. It's just one of the more relaxing things in Stardew, and I think that's why I find it a little annoying sometimes. Because it's, like, it's too relaxing, you know? I don't know. It's relaxing when you're not fighting a fish. We got our chub, so now we need to actually take it to Willy, I think. Then we get 100 golds. 
I did catch the right fish, right? Yeah, two chubs. 100 golds. I get to keep the fish. The moment the community center is open, we're going for it. I'm not even kidding when I say that. We're going straight for it. I don't have anything for you, Abigail. But of course, I'm not marrying you anyway. So it doesn't matter. It really hurts when you forget that, uh, you know, you sort of need to have inventory space. And then you realize, oh, wait, I don't have inventory space. And it hurts because you need it. I always find it funny how it always rains on the third day. This must be a coded in thing to show you how rain works, but it's also kind of annoying because, you know, I would like for it not to be raining every Wednesday of every spring of every year. Hello, Willie. Uh, you better give me my money. Hey. Chubb is an exciting catch, don't you think? Sometimes they seem so smart it's scary. Well, here's your reward. Congratulations. What do you mean they're smart? They don't fight. I will take the money, though. Thank you. Uh, a training rod. A lot easier to use, but only catch basic fish. We're going to buy this just because, you know, I sort of need to catch the fish. And I can't catch the fish if I'm using a rod that sucks. So, sorry, Willie, but your bamboo rod is useless. Oh, I can actually throw a little farther now, so that means I can actually catch the fish I want to catch. They won't be high rarity, but eh, I'm not really there for the rarity. I'm just there to catch the fish. Alright, we got a hit. Oh, look how much bigger the thing is now. See, I told you, this rod was an, a good investment. Now we can catch a lot more fish, level up our fishing skill, and live our lives. Oh, we got our first perfect, which didn't give us anything. So really, was it worth it? No. But who cares? We got fish. We need to catch more chubs later, because, well, I don't have any chubs. We missed the fish. That's not good. Oh, well. Let's head back home. Actually, since we have a better fishing rod and it's raining, it'd be a waste not to try to fish for a catfish. Since you can only get catfish in the river when it's raining in spring. So, let's do that. Oh, got green algae. That's not good. Catching a catfish should be as cat easy as... Okay. Catching a catfish should be as easy as catching, well, anything that's affordable because they don't move. So, let's give this a try. There we go. I'm going to take that this is the chub because it's not fighting back. Or a smallmouth bass. That's actually kind of inaccurate since smallmouth bass usually fight a lot more. I might as well cut down at least one tree before I go to sleep. Get some progress in, you know? I can't open the bridge if I don't have any trees. I mean wood. I always forget that I don't need to spam click the axe. This is not Terraria, so I only have to hold it. But I'm not used to that, so... I'm going to do whatever I want. I leveled up one time. That's good. So my all my efforts were not wasted. They are in good humor today. That means I have good luck. Oh, see? Already we have a new... 
Hi, me sell hats, okay? Poke, come to old, old, old hus. Poke, bring coins. Hat mouse. Okay, hat mouse, I will not be doing that. All right, now that that's done, we can head into town. If I'm correct, it's either today or tomorrow when the mines open. If it's today, then we're gonna go mining. If it's tomorrow, then, well, it's tomorrow. The mines are still closed. What a shame. I was really hoping to mine. I really hope the music isn't too loud because for me, it's blaring. I planned on spending a lot of time with my telescope this summer. Is that all you had to say to me? I don't really care about your telescope, I, but I guess it's cool. I don't know. Pierre's shop is still closed. That's such a shame. Nothing here. We got an acorn. Who throws acorns in the trash? And green algae. Okay then. We're gonna head back up to the farm so that way I can get some wood. And then, well, hopefully I'll have enough wood to build the bridge because I want the quarry as soon as possible. Not the quarry, my bad. The other side of the beach because a lot of forgeables spawn over there and a lot of forgeables mean a lot of money. And a lot of money means a very, very happy pumpkin. With my axe in hand, I'm going to go chop down a ton of trees. You know, if I can actually reach them. I should probably bring my uh, scythe at the least. And also my pickaxe. This is very obnoxious. Well, I mined as much as I could, I mean, I broke a bunch of trees, and now that I'm almost out of energy, we're just gonna stop. I don't know what I should really do now, I guess I can go hunt for those spring onions? Hello Leah. The hat mice is here, but I'm already a positive that these are gonna cost way too much. Oh yeah, a thousand gold for one hat, that's so, such a deal. It may not be a spring onion, but it's something. I'm extremely confused. I thought there was, huh, there's supposed to be spring onions here, but I'm not seeing anything, so maybe I was wrong. Well, since I can't really do anything, since I have no energy, and I don't really feel like sitting around wasting all day, we should probably go to sleep. But I really don't want to go to sleep either, because, well, what's the point? There's generally nothing I can do until the community center is open, and since neither of those are the case, I'm going to head up. And if there's nothing up here, then I'm going to sleep. We have a leak. Robin and Demetrius are here, and Sebastian's over there. But again, there's nothing really for me to do until the community center is open. So we're going to head home and go to sleep. Right after we put this leak away. Well guys, since it's 8 o'clock now, and uh, I don't have any energy still, we're going to head to sleep and call it an episode. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys all next time. Bye!